St. Paul's is the city landmark. Built by Sir Christopher I don't Bay believe at the end it. Of the 17th century, I don't believe it. Not even the blitz could destroy oh, that's the last time I trust you with anything, Since Rodney. Look, I've already told you there's something wrong with that machine. I asked him to set this to record a programme on ITV called City News. What have I got? Open University on BBC Two. So instead of keeping my fingers on the ever-changing pulse of the stock market, I'm watching Christopher Dopey Wren on how he built St Paul's Cathedral. <laughs> it's interesting. Yeah, you would. You were most probably around when he applied for planning permission. It's in here, isn't it? Is it all right if I turn the thermostat up? Yeah. You sure it's not too technical for you? <laughs> oh, you dipstick, Rodney. Now look at your damn. Me? I, I thought Rodney knew about videos. Yeah. Emmanuel in Bangkok, and that's about it. <laughs> <laughs> I programmed that computer to record the program you wanted. Now, it's not my fault if it decided to record something else, is it? That machine is... up the wall. Oh, you're trying to blind me with science now, aren't you? Personally, I think these computers are more trouble than they're worth. Where'd you figure that out? There was a film on earlier all about computers. You're joking. Oh, I wish I'd recorded it. Well, hang around, Rodney. You most probably have. <laughs> it was called War Games. It was all about this soppy kid who messes around with computers. And one day, he broke into the computer that controls the American nuclear defence system. He almost got us into World War Three. <laughs> no chance of that happening with Rodney, is there? World War Three. This plonker can't even get us into Channel Three. Have <laughs> <laughs> you read the instructions to your video recorder? <sighs> No, I haven't actually read them. Either. Well, why don't you do that small thing, Derek? I think you'll find it very interesting. Because we have instructions in German, Spanish, French and Italian, and not one single word in English. And that's why your machine don't work. It was made strictly for sale in Europe. But we are in Europe. We're in the common market, aren't we? Yes, I know that. But we've got a different electrical system to the rest of Europe. And that's why your machine is on the blink. Its components are burning out. It is what's technically known as knackered. <laughs> I'll tell you, Willie Nelson's tucked you up. Oh, I don't believe it. Well, that's all I need, isn't it? You won't be able to sell the others now, Del. Too late, I'm going to sold them all this afternoon. You've sold them? Hmm. 70, uh, 60 quid each. <laughs> you have to give the money back. Why? Because they don't work. Well, what do you expect for 60 quid? <laughs> I've been tucked up, I'm just passing it on, that's all. It's business. Oh, don't worry about it. Everything is going to be cushy. You are something else, you are. You're too picky, Rodney. That's your problem. <clears throat> what is that funny sound? I don't know. What are you looking at me for? The most funny sounds in this flat tend to emanate from your vicinity. <laughs> well, I didn't do it. <clears throat> Is that funny noise? Oh, well, shush. Right? and keep spraying. <laughs> <laughs> Just 
dropping them off. <laughs> thought you said you heard a sussing sound. I did. I was making a funny noise, like something was going to happen. The only thing that's happened so far is poor old Mum's clothing's got all dirty. I should have to take it all down to dry cleaners now. Dell, them dolls are dangerous. They've been on the news everywhere. How do you know it was them dolls that they was talking about? I know, right? I just know. Well, the only thing that I know is I've got 60 quid laying out over there. We're hanging about here like a couple of spare ones at a wedding. <laughs> <coughs> oh, come on, I've had enough of this. Come on. <laughs> Told him not to have the mutton vindaloo. <laughs> Maybe that could have happened anywhere, Rodders. No, oh, we only just got rid of them in time. We was well lucky. No. It's not luck, Rodney. It's Mum. Mum? Yeah. She's up there somewhere, watching over us. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's the old April going, is it? <laughs> 